Welcome to Embarkation Day. I just packed up all of my stuff, heading out now. I'm gonna walk downstairs, catching a taxi to the boat, and then I'm moving on to the boat. Oh my God, I'm so excited. This is crazy. I just got to my room on the ship. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm so happy right now. I literally got on like after we went through security at like the little hall that we had to enter through. We like got our little name tags and um had to go through all these little different stations. There was like a medical check-in, like this check-in at the front desk. I got my key. I'm so excited and I got the roommate that I wanted, so I'm really happy that we like got each other. Um our room is so cute. I'll give you a little tour. Um, so yeah, oh, I'm so excited. So okay. this is the door that you walk through to get into the room. Um, we have a little coat, like a little hanging thingy, probably for our keys. Um, and then like a little temperature thing. And then this is the room over here. We have some closet space and then this one. And then I'm thinking we share this. Um, and then we have a little desk with a little mirror, um, and then don't mind all my bags. And here is our bathroom. Oh, it's so cute. And then our shower has a little painting thing. Oh my gosh, obsessed. And then here are our beds. Um, how cute. We have our little window. OMG, it's gonna be so so much fun looking out that. Um, I have a little table with all my paperwork on it. This, I think, is going to be my bed. There's our TV. We have another little... I think this is the fridge. Yeah, we have a little fridge, paintings, and yeah. How cute. So yeah, that's our room. I am going to, I think, try to unpack a little bit before my roommate gets here because all my bags are taking up the entire walking space. So I think I'm going to try and get rid of some and put them under my bed so there's more room so she can unpack when she gets here. But I'm so excited. Okay, I'm going to start unpacking. Getting married at 30 is still beautiful. Starting a family after 35 years is still possible. And buying your first house after 40 is still a boss ass move. Don't let people rush you with their timelines. Just move as you Just move as you. Pretty good on you Taking a year to go and travel the world Could be when you're 42 Still in love with your soul At 80 Drinking your coffee and going on dates There's no rushing No timelines Just move as you Move as you Just move as you Just move as you When you're 16 Full of dreams they'll tell you how it should be Just go on and make your own life Don't let people rush you With their timeline Move as you Just move as you Just move as you Just move as you just finished unpacking the room looks so good we were like really cramped on space though so i tried my best to like 
get everything organized but i'll show you how it kind of turned out so i just have my bed i have my extra pillow that i brought in my blanket that i brought brought um my laundry bag with all the laundry i wore in thailand i'm not really quite sure where to put that so it's kind of just at the end of my bed i stored my um protein bars in the fridge because that's like the only place <laughs> that i had room to store them and then under my bed i just have all three of my luggages with some packing cubes that i um finished this i was thinking i might wear later for the um uh, lifeboat drill because you have to be like completely covered pa like long pants long sleeves like etc so i thought i would change into that um this is all just my chargers that i need to put and then i'll probably store them down there i have my beats sunglasses and my apple watch and then in here i just put some hand sanitizer my like sleeping mask and some sticky notes and then next to my window like side i have my journal my polaroid camera some extra film sticky notes and then my water bottles and then over here, so our desk, I just put my backpack down there with all of my like folders and notebooks and stuff. And then in here, I just have all of my like textbooks and stuff in here for my classes. And then um, this one's empty for my roommate. And then down here, I have like all my medicines back there and then some extra clothing storage because I li literally ran out in my closet, but I have t-shirts and then like, um, like basic layer layering shirts and then down there is my roommate's area and then here i just have laptop ipad folder papers etc on my side of the desk and then in the closet this one is for my roommate this one is mine i just have my little closet organizer thing with like basic necessities socks underwear etc bathroom stuff just like a bunch of random stuff that I had to put store in there. Up here I have some pajamas and then some like extras of everything basically. And then here's all the clothes that I hung. My shoes are down there along with the beach towel because that was like the only place I had room to put it. Um, and then in here I just have some athletic t-shirts and then back there I have like all my going out shirts. Thought we could like split this between my, my roommate and then this shelf would be for my roommate. This one is mine. I have all my pants, jeans, skirts, long pants, athletic shorts, etc. And then down there is another area that I thought we could like split because it's like a hanging area. So I have like all of my leggings, sports bras, and then just a random sweatshirt on top because again, ran out of room to put stuff. And then in here is the bathroom. I put all my stuff on this like little shelf with like my toilet kit, makeup, headbands, etc. And then on my side, I have my hairbrush, face wash, toothpaste, that stuff. And then I put all of my like stuff for the bathroom out there. There's like two more shelves so we could use those. Get a fun little mirror. <laughs> and then in the shower, I have my like body wash, con conditioner, and shampoo which i don't think there's another like hanging area so i might have to put some of that on the ground but that's okay so yeah that is the final unpacked room um i don't even know what time it is right now i think it's almost 12 30. we have lunch being served until i think 2 30. my roommate's getting here in about 15 minutes so that's so exciting i think i'm gonna wait for her and then maybe get lunch at some point but yeah, that is what I'm doing right now. I'm just chilling in my room. Might go and try and find like the water fill, water bottle filling station, but. At 80, drinking your <laughs> so we had a like, meeting tonight earlier and then before that we had like this whole like um dean welcome meeting in the union which is like the big room where like global studies is and then we had our individual c meeting so i'm in the adriatic c so we met with them um we met in lido so it's like on deck nine at the top um, which was super fun and I just got back to my room and took a shower and I'm watching Mean Girls so it was such a fun day. We also had a lifeboat drill this morning like after lunch which I'll insert like a picture. But yeah.
that was fun too. So, so exciting for the rest of the week. We am, we disembark tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. So we're gonna wake up early, get breakfast around 7 a.m. and then go to the back of the boat to watch us leave the port. And then we're on our way to Malaysia. So exciting. Thank you.